hail and well met, fellow true believers. I'm Nick Klein, the artist on Thor number 12. The process for Thor was um, the same process I, I usually do, which is uh, first when I get the script is uh, I give it a thorough read, of course. Um, and then I usually make a list of stuff that I would need for reference or that maybe I have, you know, that maybe that I haven't heard of. So I usually ask uh, my editor in this case, Lauren Tankovich, uh, um, to mail me whatever reference she has. And then I go into a layout phase where I usually start laying out the whole book and make kind of an image map um, where I have all the pages uh, next to each other the way they would appear in a printed book. So I know what page goes next to to the other page. So there's no uh, sometimes there's there's weird tangent stuff that can, that can happen if you don't uh, if you don't see the pages next to each other. So I usually try to avoid that. Once I have the layout fi figured out, um, I usually go right into the the penciling phase, which nowadays I do pretty much 100% digitally um, because uh, digital just has great editing options. Um, can, you know, if you if you screw up drawing a, a large head or something, you don't have to erase and redraw it. You can just you know shrink it down and position it, or you can just even in the layout phase, it's, it's much easier to try different things than it would be on uh, with pencil and paper because you can just move stuff around so much easier and uh, and scale it and whatever. And then I usually uh, I print out I, I I turn out my I turn my pencils blue, so it looks like like a blue line drawing, and I print it out on. Uh, on 11 by 17 paper, and I ink it using whatever I have laying around, usually a brush, nibs, uh, some microns maybe, uh, especially for straight lines with a ruler. Um, and from there on, um, I scan it, um, which I have an uh, oversized scanner for, which is great, so you don't have to have, um, have the pages uh, in, in pieces and put them back together in Photoshop. It saves a lot of time and a lot of, uh, a lot of stress. <laughs> Um, and then I go into Photoshop and start coloring. Um, and the first pages of a scene are usually the hardest because you have to figure out a, a, a lightning or like a, a, the mood that you want to establish for the scene. Um, and once you have that first page out of a scene, if there's a scene that has more pages than one to it, then um, it's basically downhill from there. And then I send it off to Marvel.